Laureus 2023 World Sports no. Woman. Laureus 2023. No. 2023 Laureus World. Sports Woman of the Year. Can you relax? I need you to relax. Sherry Richardson. First of all, doubters. Backpedal. Do it. I want to see you backpedal. Because the hate was real. She's washed up. She's a flop. She smoked too much weed. She do of it. I still had faith in her. And because of that, I've been labeled somewhat of a, a Shakari stan. I'll take that. I'll take it. But you know what's going to happen now? Now you're going to show me some respect. I want my respect. Things are looking up, Reggie. Oh, here comes Sha'Carri Richardson up on her toes, and she's going to win here in Doha. Sha'Carri Richardson <laughs> enjoying the atmosphere here in Nairobi. Which leads me to my next question. Where's Shelly? I thought the Shelly Ann Fraser Price was named the 2023 Laura, 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 Laurius. Laurius. Laurie. No. Laurius? It's Laurius. All right, damn. 2023 Laurius World Sportswoman of the Year. Never heard of that before, but uh, oh, it seems like a big deal. So big up the one named Shelly Ann Fraser Price, yo. Yeah. Yeah. But when are you racing again? Matter of fact, when are you going to race against Shakari? It was supposed to happen in Botswana. Been in the 200 after being kicked out of the 100. It was supposed to happen in Nairobi. I ran in the 200. I was kicked out. I Like I stated, I was kicked out of my hundreds besides Doha. What the f is happening, man? And yo, on top of that, Shelly Ann Fraser Price has reportedly pulled out of the Botswana Continental Tour. Shelly Ann Fraser Price unfortunately had to withdraw from the highly anticipated Kip Kino Classic. What's with the athlete pullout game these days? Athletes, listen to me very closely. You must make earlier public statements when you're not going to be competing in an event. Can you imagine a boxing match, a uh, MMA fight, a, a, a game of tennis where an athlete is supposed to show up and they just don't? It's like you got to hold your breath till these cats get to the line, yo. <laughs> Race on Saturday, you're liable on Thursday to hear, well, such and such isn't going to be running, just so y'all know. No, you, you never I'm know. Done hey, you, sound, you, sound, you sound kind of mad about that. I'm bro. done getting hyped for races, dog. Your name on the start list don't mean you're going to start. And then you don't even hear from them. Make public statements. Be professional. People won't treat the sport like a professional sport if you don't. God damn it. Speaking of matchups, track beef is getting real right now. You got Fred Curley, Marcel Jacobs, Tara Davis, and Kwanisha Burks. But is it not clearer than day that matchups and rivalries wake this sport up? Look what's been happening. And I'm not saying to create fake beef, but the athletes just need to be real, man. They need to get up with the program. Cool fact, in the UK, specifically London, when you say someone's beefing, you're saying that they stink. Hey, you just heard me talking about getting with the program, and there's certain athletes in track and field today that just get it. Noah Lyles gets it. Grant Holloway gets it. Tara Davis gets it. Shakari Richardson gets it. There's certain athletes that when they post on Instagram, when they tweet, when they get on a microphone, when they get on camera, when they get in a competition, they just get it. Obviously, you got to be at a certain level. But if you're at that level, give us something. Shit. I want to close off with a question. In general, is it smart to switch events mid-career? Not saying any names, but I will say this. You know the smart switch app you use when you get a new phone? Well, for those who don't know, it's an app that you use when you get a new phone to transfer the data from the old device to the new one. It can be tricky. And it can be kind of tedious, but it's very important that you do it correctly. If not, you could lose all your data on both phones. And then the new phone, 
just isn't as good as the old one. Then it makes you think, damn, I really didn't need a new phone. <laughs>